on camera scary moments in Phoenix when a woman was approached by a man with a shotgun right after she finished a transaction at an ATM. Fortunately, she did get away unharmed. But now Silent Witness needs your help finding the guy with the shotgun. Team 12's Colleen Sakura is breaking down what happened and has some tips to keep you safe. Colleen? It's not something you really anticipate happening when you come to the ATM, but it happened here at 35th Avenue and Thunderbird. And now Silent Witness is looking for the guy who did it. Surveillance video off an ATM machine captures scary moments from August 15th at 930 at night. A woman gets in her car. Silent Witness says the man wearing a red bandana over his face approached her with a shotgun. They said he started to say something to her, but she drove away. Deanne Huff, who visits this ATM at Thunderbird and 35th Avenue often, was surprised to hear this happen. I always try to, you know, look around, but ATMs do make me a little bit nervous, especially if I'm trying to get cash out. But Sergeant Jamie Rothschild with Silent Witness says the woman in the video did all the right things. We always encourage people to be aware of your surroundings. And in this case, it sounds like the victim was ultra aware of what was going on because the moment she saw that guy coming up to her, she got out of there. And that's what we want. Rothschild says because money is involved in this kind of situation, it's important to be extra aware, free of distractions, and trust your gut. We always want you to stack the odds in your favor. We want people who care about you to know where you are, preferably to even be with you. If you can do it during the daytime in a well-lit, well-populated area, even better. The search is now on for the man in the video, last seen leaving in a red sedan. We're fortunate that she got out of there because something didn't look right. Now we need someone to tell us who this guy is. In Phoenix, Colleen Sakura, 12 News. Thank you very much, Colleen. Yeah, we uh, we want you to go ahead and send in tips to 480 Witness. If you know who the guy in the video is, you're asked to call that number 480 Witness.